Hi, this is Dr. Don, and I have another problem out of the homework in McClave. And in this one, we're given a question that says a multinomial experiment with k equal 4 cells and n equal 400 produce the data over here in this table. They want to, us to show, is there sufficient evidence to contradict the null hypothesis that Proportion 1 is 0.2, proportion 2 is 0.4, proportion 3.1, proportion 4 is 0.3, with an alpha 0.05. And the first question is choose the null and alternative. And the null is always no difference, which means that the proportions we observe will be the same as these uh, proportions there. The alternative is at least one of the proportions differs, and there's ways we can find out which one later on. But for this test, we just want to know, does the distribution match? And if it does, uh, then we do not reject the null. If it does not match, then we do reject the null. Okay, let's go ahead over here. We're going to click on a little icon. I want to open this in StatCrunch. And we get this data here. I'm going to change the name of that so that I can um, understand it. I'm going to label that observed. And the first thing we need, um, we're, we're given proportions here. So I'm going to put my P in there. And it's 0 0.2, enter, 0 0.4, enter, 0 0.1, enter. 0.3 enter. Let me double check. That's 4 and 4 and 2. That's 1. So I've got my observed proportions. I need my observed, uh, my excuse me, expected proportions. I need my expected counts. We're going to use data, compute, expression to do this. Click on the build. And I want to take my proportions, multiply them times the count total, which was 400 and click OK, and we're going to call this EXPECTED, -E expected, and click on Compute. And so now we've got a column with expected, and we've got observed. So once we get that, we can jump on to Stat, Goodness of Fit, because we're trying to match the null hypothesis proportion distribution to alternative chi-square test. And we need our observed, which is going to be observed. Our expected, expected. We're just going to leave those as they are. Click on Compute. And we get an answer here. We get a chi-square test statistic of 19.452 and a p-value of 0 0.002, which is what they're asking there. 19.452.002. The fact that the p-value is less than alpha of 0 0.005 tells us to reject the null. But just for fun, let's go ahead and get the rejection uh, region as well. We've got k equal 4, so that should be 3. Whoops, I've got to select my right tail. I clicked on the wrong thing there. And this is 0.05. So my uh, critical value of chi square is 7.8. My test statistic is 19. So it's way out here. And that's the reason that the p-value is so low, because we're way out there. So again, that means we reject the null. There is sufficient evidence that the multinomial probabilities differ. I hope this helps.